I'm here to introduce you guys to where I live. Um, I live in a church and I did talk about that, not really talk about that, but mentioned that a couple of days ago. I pay absolutely zero for my room as well as I get free meals four times a day, so it is an opportunity if you attend this church. There's, you know, this branch is in 88 different countries in the world. So if you are deciding to go on some form of trip through the IYF, good chance for you to see what the place looks like so I did want to show you what my room looks like so I really should be filming this in the morning but I'm not and I'm filming it at night hope you forgive me for the terrible lighting um yeah yeah okay so this is my door it has a sign right here Nagar ten and smile when you go out you should smile Durol tedo smile when you come in also smile the light is directly to left and then you see these closets so basically each one is for a different person um, we don't all live in here but there's a room next door that has a lot of different high school students so the high some of the high school students don't have a proper place to put their stuff so they put it in here this one with the apple towel is mine so I'll show you so basically I have my jackets and sweaters here and then I have my makeup and kafunkles and blah 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 here. It's obviously not that organized. My hats, some chargers uh, down here. I have pants and whatever. Oh and then I have like socks and like underwear and stuff in there and like I have extra bags up there. So it's quite a lot of space actually. Don't really need more space than that. Just close that up. Yeah, over there I also hang my winter jacket as long, uh, um, along with my other friends and their stuff. Um, I do keep my camera, some books and whatever up here. These are my art supplies here, so my friend stuff here, whatever, scissors, chargers, batteries. And we have these books. None of these are mine, these are all my friend stuff. This is my mirror though. I um, also have a light right here, it turns on automatically, you open it up, right? That's cool, right? I know. So here are all these books and whatever, another mirror, a small one, then a big one, again, I look like a hot mess. You have another, like, Chester drawer right here. I keep like some stuff here, it's my dirty clothes as well. And then I show you. Top drawer is mine. You can't really see too well, but it's heat tools and some face products and stuff like that. Focus camera, focus, you can do it. There you go. This one as well is also my drawer. And I just have like medicine, you know vitamins, um, extra bags, plastic bags, etc. You know, all the stuff that doesn't need anything in specific. Just to give you a full view of the desk, this is what it looks like. There's also storage here, but none of that is mine. We take turns, so each of us clean the floor two times a week and take out the little mini trash, but that's about it. This is my friend's bed. And she's the youngest, she has the most space, but trust me, she loves to sleep, so I think she deserves it. There's like this little cut in here that you can kind of like just, you know, like the bunk beds here. So I sleep on the bottom one, and my friend sleeps on the top one. She's a year older, no, four years older than me. And I sleep here, just an extra studying desk here that we can use. It's like a pull-out one, and you can put it on top of the bed. Also use that a lot. Um, also in here, um, you can't really see, but I keep my um, my ring light and like my camera stand over in that dark corner. Yeah, this is the room. Pretty spacious, right? Yeah, so it's a pretty big room as you can see. Um, I fit very comfortably in it. Um, also, we have this uh, veranda. Not really veranda. It's really dark. 
Uh, I wonder if there's a light out here. There probably is. How do I, how do, I do that? Aha! Figured out the light out here. Actually, it's pretty spacious out here too, so we have the space all to ourselves. Dry our clothes here or on this rack thingy that is pretty cool. You just kind of snap it out like, like that and you can hang your clothes on it. I have my suitcases back there, if you can see. Don't you guys just love how childish I am? This is my favorite one. Isn't she just the beautiest thing? The prettiest thing in life? So, my suitcase, like my, um, my carry-on, I have the bigger one matching it thanks to my auntie. She got me this for my birthday as well as this bag when we were in Japan because it's my favorite character. Gudetama! Gude, Gudetama! And also I got Gudetama stickers myself at Loft in Japan because I'm obsessed. Let me show you, let me show you. Let me show you. Isn't he just the cutest thing since ever? Like, he is literally my life. This bottom. Look at it. Look at that bottom. I also got this. It looks very Japan-esque, doesn't it? I even have this, like, this pin that I got at Law from Japan that says Utadaro. Like, it's, it's literally the best. Um, it's even got like a space for laptop. It's fully padded. There's lots of like pockets on the inside and the outside as well as like you know, here's really padded as well. It is probably the best bag I could have ever asked for. But I didn't get it in Japan, actually. I got it in Ide in Korea. Now that you see the room, I hope that you like it. I am very pleased with it. I didn't expect it to be so nice. It's a really large room. It's really comfortable and really spacious for the three of us. Um, and we keep it clean, so that's really awesome as well, especially since I'm paying absolutely zero for this room. If you're wondering like what I do in return, like obviously there has to be a catch. Um, nothing really, everything is, you know, up to aims, but I do go to service, but I would have even if I didn't stay here. I do the dishes with every, all the other youths once a week, just about, so I also wipe the floor twice a week. So we exchange the three of us just because we, our hair, like, falls out all over the floor and that's the only way to take care of it. I also get optional three meals a day free here as well and, um, yeah, really enjoying life inside of church and, you know, a lot of people think it's really hard, really strict, really annoying. Every time I say I live in church, they're like, <gasps> you live in church? How? Why? Cry! It's great, guys. It's... Amazing. If you're curious about how I got to stay in such an awesome room for absolutely zero or you're wondering about the International Youth Fellowship and what we do here or what they do here or what the hell it even is, then please give me a like and leave me a comment down below about the specific questions you have for me and what kind of information you would like and I'll make another video and or answer your question down in the comment section below if it's simple enough. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more videos about Korean, about Asia, about culture, about language, about whatever I have on this channel, please do click the red button down below and subscribe to my channel and become one of us. I'm gonna call us coffee beans for now, you know, y'all are able to change that whenever you want, but you know, um, join us coffee beans and you know, we'll creates a wonderful unicorn paradise. <laughs> Cultural appropriation. I decided to make this video after I saw this video by Yuta. I don't know if you guys know him, but you probably do because he is amazing. And if you don't know him, you should really check him out. His links are in the description box below. Basically, he did an interview with Japanese 